Innovate is a global model developed with extensive research, keeping in mind the requirements of Indian customers. Honda's back. The no-nonsense SUV. Fun to drive. Very, very refined car. Valuable addition to the segment. In terms of design, it's got a very uh, bold front end uh, with the cliff-like front. Big gaping grills, all that I think gives it a lot of road presence. Look, proper SUV with a promising stance from the front, a huge grill, smaller lights, so that presence is amazing, which is lacking in most of the so-called SUVs in India. very balanced looking car and a very typically SUV looking car. I mean, if you do a, in school, if you do the, like a shape of an SUV, that's what, that's what this would be. I think for me, the, the sheer size of the car, you know, the segment it's trying to address, the kind of customer it's trying to address, I think that's something they'll really be impressed by. I think in the rear is really fascinating with the connected LED tail lights, really something like a futuristic look. The car looks a very balanced package for uh, both urban and uh, highway commute or drive. The overall body proportions, it's, it's, a, it's a very balanced car. You know, you cannot really add anything to it or take away anything from it. It's a complete design. The rest of the cars have the lines, the bonnet styling is on the side of the car. But it seems that it's going solid on the road. I think really for me the surprise was the cabin, but frankly, it's not such a surprise because uh, packaging has been a strength and uh, really good. Both the front seats and the back seats are uh, uh, really, really very comfortable. For Indian customer, the spacious cabin and the comfortableness is very important. It is because they like the long journeys. So we made a really spacious cabin with a good seat for long journeys. Uh, Honda, as always, packaging geniuses, uh, managing to take every last millimeter of space in the cabin and maximize it. The cabin is very roomy, especially at the back. Uh, I experienced it for quite a bit. Uh, lots of light and air coming in. Seats are very comfortable. Lots of leg room, el elbow room. So I think that's a big plus. And what I like most is the space inside uh, Elevate and the boot space. That's also, I think that's number one in this segment. The most important thing is boot space. Four people can come into this car easily, which is a very big challenge when you take a long route to a SUV. I love that new infotainment entertainment system. I love the fact that you can switch the wireless charger on and off because sometimes you want to use the place as a storage place and sometimes you want to charge your phone. So I think this is the only car in this segment where you have a direct button that lets you do that. So while Elevate also maybe can do with one or two more features, but all the absolute must-have features that you're looking for in this segment are there in this vehicle. I think the engine really, really impresses in terms of the refinement. Well, being a naturally aspirated engine, there's a lot that it offers in terms of the performance. I think it's a very powerful engine. It's smooth and uh, power delivery happens very smoothly. Engine, I've always been a big fan of the 1.5 uh, from Honda. The iV Tech is there for a purpose, and I think with this one, they have tuned it very well for a variety of usage patterns. Engine performance, no doubt, NVH levels में काफी अच्छा काम किया गया है. तो इसी वजह से जब आप चला रहे होते हैं, गाड़ी चला रहे होते हैं, या फिर एकदम से रफ्तार बढ़ने की कोशिश करते हैं, तो वहाँ पर आपको under performance नजर नहीं आती है. CVT offers seamless and smooth shifting of gears, and uh, which offers peace of mind when you are in bumper to bumper traffic or even during the ghats when you were crying the CVT was amazing it was shifting quick and it was punchy. Hondas have always been known for their involving drive so the steering response the way it weighs up it's all organic it doesn't feel you know like it's forced. Same with the suspension setup the ride and handling balance I think it's just beautiful I think probably uh, it's the best in that sense that it offers you the best ride and handling balance. The ride and handling is the trump card of the Elevate. I think it 